Welcome, welcome. For today's video, I'm going to check out Go Go Loser Ranger. Go Go Loser Ranger is a Japanese superhero anime series based on the manga of the same name written and illustrated by Negi Haruba. And this is one I was looking forward to as the title itself just reminds me of uh, the Power Rangers. Anyways, let's check out the series. So the series begins 13 years ago when the villainous army of evil attempt to invade the earth and they have a big ass fortress floating in the fucking sky like some castle in the sky type of shit. Luckily there are some heroes here to kick evil's ass. They are the Super Sentai Squadron known as Ryujin Sentai Dragon Keepers and we get to see them kick a lot of ass. Anyways, we are in the present day where the Dragon Keepers are having a big ass stadium of their upcoming match. And it turns out the Dragon Keepers are recruiting and this guy here is hating as fuck. <laughs> like bruh, if they existed in my world, I would join in a fucking heartbeat. Anywho, we get to the upcoming match. Also, this monster here turns into this. Shit just went from 0 to 100 real fucking quick. God damn, who knew trucks were that powerful? No wonder Isekai Pro Tags get killed by them. Anywho, the rangers kick their asses by using one of their divine tools called Dragon Breath to wipe them out, except for one foot soldier. Imagine owning the world's greatest love song. Cause I know where you live. That'll sweep you off your feet. You're the reason I wake up with a massive erection. And it turns out all of this shit is just a farce. As the dragon keepers made a deal with the monsters that the keepers would let them live if they can just make a monster every Sunday so the keepers can kick its ass and look good for the public. However, one of the soldiers, Spider D, is having none of this shit and is tired of it all. <laughs> And so during the battle, he tries to kick their asses and surprisingly gets some motivation. Huh? Oh, and he gets some words from the Red Ranger himself. God damn, I didn't know Japan has their own Japanese homelander. Anywho, he manages to survive and escape without a trace. And it turns out he's the hater from earlier. And he decides that he will defeat the Dragon Keepers by infiltrating their organization. So that was the first episode. And god damn, I'm liking it. Like the animation again is top notch. Like god damn, look at these fight scenes. I also love the Super Sentai aesthetic, or as we know it in the West, the Power Ranger aesthetic. And how it pokes fun on the Rangers as here they're the bad guys of the group, only wanting to make themselves look popular to the masses, while the monsters here are the underdogs of this series. It reminds me of the film Megamind. And speaking of which, even the main character, Fighter D, kind of reminds me of Mega Man. Sort of. Well, he doesn't want to be the loser anymore, and wants to kick the Rangers' asses. So yeah, so the comedy's good, the action scenes are good, I'm liking the characters. 
and I can't wait to see more. And so yeah, that's pretty much it. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos just like this. Oh, and if you like my work, support the channel at Ko-Fi. There you can support the channel and help me produce these videos. And in return, you get to have their names in the credits, and you could drop suggestions for me to check out. And if you do support me, I thank you very much, and I appreciate it very much. So stay safe out there, and goodbye. Go, go, loser rangers. Do, 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 do. Go, go, loser rangers. Coco Loser Rangers, you mighty Northman Loser Rangers.